Andre in the commentary. Uh, welcome to the follow-up edition of Talking Shit today. We've had a long day with Mr. Donald Trump motherfucking bullshit. Uh, fuck a Fox of News uh, to get us going. Apparently Donald Trump is announcing in his press conference today and his speech that he is going to bring on these killers, he called them. He said that that, that he knows killers, uh, killers that will uh, take on uh, uh, people like China, and killers that will take on Mexico, and killers that will take on uh, the financial uh, 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 business over uh, on Wall Street when he quoted some names and did some name dropping of the very people who created our uh, financial catastrophe as Wall Street is sort of on a, a roller coaster ride this week uh, with the Dow going up and down, losing 500 points uh, in, in earlier parts of the week, uh, at the end of last week, earlier part of this week. Uh, Donald Trump is uh, full of shit. <clears throat> this is the this is what the GOP has led us to. See, by their uh, grand old opposition tactics during the uh, uh, beginning, middle, and now end of the Obama, Obama administration denying every positive aspect of what the president had tried to do to create uh, 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 some clarity in regards to the river uh, of cesspool bullshit uh, that the Bush administration left us with. Uh, and now we're faced with this nincompoop. Uh, this motherfucker is crazy. You know, uh, he threw out uh, 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 Univision anchor uh, Jorge Ramos, who was asking some very, very uh, important questions, and Ramos almost began to sort of debate him and speak at the end uh, of the press conference, and he answered uh, Ramos several times uh, in regards to his sort of umbrella-type response on how he treats Hispanic people. Uh, Donald Trump earlier this month has referred to Hispanics as, quote, Mexico people, unquote. So his attitude toward the woman over at Fox News, the uh, president of uh, Fox News has, uh, or actually Fox in general, Addison, has asked uh, uh, Trump to knock it off and apologize to this woman for character assassinating her. Uh, it, it, he, he won't let up. He's not going to let up, see? He's not going to let up, see? And, 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 and if Donald Trump thinks that financial sh success should be based on filing bankruptcy and then opening up a fucking casino or a golf course across the street from what he already bankrupt, uh, and, and he considers that successful financing, then thank God uh, we've already killed the idea of uh, putting Social Security on the stock market because we cannot afford to file bankruptcy our way through negotiations with other countries and trade agreement. Donald Trump's success is based on bankruptcy and filing lawsuits against people who tell him about his bullshit. Donald Trump's success is based on lawsuits for people who tell him about the bullshit he pulls when he is about to file bankruptcy and do some more trickery. Donald Trump is a liar. Donald Trump has personal self-centered desires. Donald Trump is not an official uh, representation of what it takes to really clean up the GOP and its misinterpretation of the Constitution of this nation. Donald Trump is a fucking liar. Donald Trump has personal desires that do not include people who ain't got shit. And these people who have this false hope, white supremacy, let's go watch the lynchings again attitude about this country are being lost in the dust of history and the trust that we put in God himself when it comes to this idiotic racism and uh, uh, anti-growth uh, and immigration uh, policy that these uh, racist KKK members want to, uh, a place they want to come from. And then he said that the Bible is his favorite book. Uh, he never quoted any scripture. Usually when people uh, say something that they favor, they can quote it. or something. He said the Bible is his favorite book. The Bible is his favorite book. The Bible is his favorite book. The Bible? Let me tell you something about this motherfucker. He's tribal. He does not have a conclusive antidote for the kinds of troubles that have this country at his throat. What is Donald Trump going to do about racism? 
He's going to go and discriminate against anybody that's a little darker than him and put them back over the border or on the boat again. I mean, come on, the policy and the theology of this man's a psychological output on data is ridiculous. It's fine. It's crazy. This motherfucker is a bankrupt idealist when it comes to the most important concepts, and, and, and it doesn't make him a realist. It makes him an angry, uh, lion-ass motherfucker who's learned the system of a down. Uh, 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 and I don't even think he'll have the decency to let any other trickle down to about we want to be rich. His friends are already rich. He said that he is the king of how this all works. Then he is one of those self-centered Wall Street jerks. This motherfucker is a monster. I don't see how people can have the desire to have this kind of hair on fire motherfucker do anything other than shut the fuck up. Dump Trump is a dump truck of bullshit that doesn't help the common citizens. And these people who sit around and rally for him are in the same kind of delusional thinking that doesn't have shit to do with true brotherhood. This is fucking bullshit. This is why the Ku Klux Klan wears their hoods. This is bullshit. This is bullshit. This is bullshit. Wall Street tycoon motherfucking baboon. Uh, he's a buffoon. He's an idiot. And he will not be the president of this country. He will not be the president of this country. He will not be the president of this country. He will be the president of another bankrupt company that he will walk across the street and start out over again with a new name or a new shame or a new aim other than honesty, integrity, and his own fucking uh, accountability skills. He, can't, he He's accountable to himself. This motherfucker need to put these age-old, self-centered, racist, uh, homophobic ideas on a shelf. We need something that's going to lift us up beyond what has always dragged us down. Self-centered, greedy, angry white men clowns. I'm sick of his bullshit. When is it going to end, for God's sake? Please bring an end to this bullshit. Please bring an end, God, to this motherfucking bullshit. Stop him. Let him go and run ISIS, for God's sake. That is the nicest way that we can deal with his sick fucking ass. Donald Trump's bullshit is coming to an end. It's not going to last. This, thing, this country needs something from within. He's on top, looking down, and being the fucking clown that he is. In addition to all of that, they can quit it with this adolescent sort of attitude, civil and rivalry kind of bullshit. I'm talking about Donald Trump and the, uh, the, the, the Fox News motherfuckers. Thank you, YouTube, for allowing me uh, uh, every time I can remember to say fuck Fox News from here until next November, along with Donald Trump's fucked up weave having ass. Thank you.